Hi learners, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today we'll do the part seven of the same topic that is the perimeter and area. So we'll see the exercise 17.3. So find the circumference and area of a circle of that is the radius is given as 10.3. I'll just write it here. This is 10.5 centimeter. So now radius is 10.5. For you want the circumference of the circle. So circumference of the circle means the formula is 2 pi r. So here this is the pi. Pi can be you can write your pi as 22 by 7, or we can also write that is 3.14. When you divide it, you will get 3.14. Or the standard value is given. Or always that is 3.14. So here I've written 27. 22 by 7 then it is easy for the calculation so the radius is 10.5 so when you divide it that is 1.5 when you multiply this all that is going to be 66 centimeter then the area of circle the area of circle is pi r square that will be 22 by 7 r is 10.5 you write it two times again this you are going to simplify that will be 1.5 when you multiply all these three that will be 346.5 centimeter square now when it is given 4.2, the radius is 4.2, same, you will start with the circumference of circle, that is 2 pi r, just plug in the values, that is 22 by 7 into 4.2, 7 ones are 7, 0 0.6, multiply this, you get 26.4, area of circle is pi r square, 22 by 7, r is 4.2, you will write it two times, simplify this one, multiply this, that will be 55.44 centimeter square. Find the circumference and area of a circle of diameter. So the diameter here is given as 42. So first thing what are we going to do? You are going to find the radius. So you know the radius is the half of the diameter. So d by 2. That will be 42 by 2. That will be 21 meter. Because here in this one you need the radius in circumference and the area. Circumference is 2 pi r. Same formula. That will be here also. We can write a 3.14. That 3.14 is given. So this is 20, 21. So when you multiply this, that will be 131.88, or you can also round it. That will be 132 meter. Then the area of circle that is pi r square that will be 3.14 into 21 into 21. So when you multiply, that will be 1384.74 meter square. So again, here the diameter is given as 60. So the radius is going to be half of it. That is going to be 30. So the circumference again here, 2 into pi here, 3.14. And this is 30. So when you multiply, you get 188.4 centimeter. Then the area of circle, pi r square, 3.14. Radius is 30. You will write it two times. Multiply, that will be 2826 centimeter square. Now they said here, find the, you have to find the area of a circle whose diameter is 14 centimeters. So diameter is 14 means the radius is going to be half of it, that will be 7. And you have to find the area of circle. So if this area of circle is pi r square. So you can also write here pi as 22 by 7, r 7 into 7. This 7 goes, that will be 154 centimeter square. Now here, if the circumference of a circle is 132 centimeter you have to find the radius and the area of the circle so we'll start with the given things what is given here that is circumference of circle that is 2 pi r so now the circumference of circle is this means this is given as 132 so below this one you will write a 132 2 into 22 by 7 and uh, we don't know the radius so what will you do here 132 you will keep it as it is this will go this 7 will go on the other side so it is going to get multiplied this 2 will go on the other side means it is going to go in the denominator and this r is on the right hand side so it will stay the same so here 2 ones are 263 now here sorry uh, not uh, 60 uh, not 63 sorry 132 divided by 2 so that will be 2 6 are 12 and this will be 2 6 are that will be 66 Mm, just one minute. This will be 66. 
yeah that should be 66 and then you will write here 22 ones and 22 threes are that is 66 so here what you get here this will be 7 into 3 that is going to be 21 that is half the radius is 21 centimeter and then we got the circumference uh, here so now why did we uh, start with the circumference because the question here it was given the circumference was given so it was easy to find out the radius of it now we'll find out the area so area of circle pi r square so 22 by 7 you know now r is 21 into 21 so that will be 7 ones are 7 threes are when you multiply this you get 1386 centimeter square now the radius of two concentric circle circles having the same center means now two concentric circles means now here the center is going to be the same here the uh, radius is given this is 10 means the inner one will be 10 and the outer one from here to here this is going to be 20 hope you got this one this is the outer one from here to here is going to be 20 and the inner one the small one that is going to be from here to here is going to be 10 so that is given the radius of this one so 10 and 20 respectively by how much does the area of the outer circle exceed the area of the inner circle so now what you'll do we'll just consider r1 and r2 let r1 be the radius of the inner circle that is 10 centimeter and r2 be the radius of the outer circle that is 20 centimeters so we have given the names r1 and r2 now the first we'll see the area of the inner circle now area also we'll let this make it to a1 capital a1 so that will be pi r1 square so pi into r1 is 10 10 square that will be 100 pi square centimeter area so we have to write in square centimeter so area of outer circle that is a2 that will be pi r2 square so r2 we have considered this as 20 so now this is going to be 20 square means 20 into 20 that is going to be 400 and this pi as it is and that is in square centimeter and they have asked for the how much does the area of the outer circle exceed the area of the inner circle so what are you going to do you are going to find the difference between it so a2 minus a1 so area of the second minus area of the one first one so that will be you got your 400 pi minus you got this as 4, 400 uh, this 100 pi so 400 minus 100 means that is going to be 300 pi so now what will you do you'll write a 300 and now you'll write the value of this pi either write 22 by 7 or 3.14 so when you multiply this you get 942 square centimeter the inner circumference of a circular garden is 440 centimeter you have to find its radius and area so circumference of circle is what the formula is 2 pi r so this is given as 2 440 means the circumference of circle is given as 440 so 2 into 22 by 7 and we don't know the radius so now 440 will keep as it is on that side if we take this 7 this goes here that will be in the numerator if you take this on the other side that will be in the denominator so this r stays the same here 2 ones are 2 we can also want we can do one thing over here because you can see 440 here and 22 so we can see here 440 divided by 22 so 22 twos are 44 and this one zero and then what will you do here two ones are two tens or you can also write this divide by two first and both is the same you'll get the same answer so this is going to be 10 sevens are is going to be 70 that is the radius of it 70 centimeter and now we want the area area of circle means that is pi r square so 22 by 7 and you got r as 70 into 70 so 2 ones are 2 tens are so this when you multiply this one that will be 15400 area so we have to write in centimeter square now find the radius of a circle whose circumference yeah, circumference is same as the perimeter of a square of side 22 meters so your perimeter of a square of side 22 means the side of the square is given so side of square that is important and not the side of this this one so this will be 22 meter so perimeter of square means the formula is you know this is a square perimeter means the sum of all sides that is side into side in, side plus side plus side plus side that will be 4s so 4 into that side is given as 22 that is going to be 88 meter and now it is given here circumference is same as the perimeter of square so circumference of circle because the perimeter of square is 88 means the circumference of circle also is 88 meter so now you will write with the formula for this one circumference of circle means it is going to be 2 pi r and that is 88 so why are we doing this that means we can get the radius of this one so now we got with this one 
after solving this putting the values so r will be 88 this will go here that will be in the numerator and this will go in the denominator after changing the side 22 ones are 22 fours are 2 ones are 2 twos are that will be 7 twos are 14 meter so that is what they have asked find the radius of a circle so we got the radius of a circle so by this one we have completed today's work do like and subscribe to my channel so you get the notification of other parts thank you